Welcome aboard the BioTrain. This video is straight from the notebook with ecological pyramids. Ecological pyramids represent the trophic levels in a food chain. The trophic level is the position that an organism takes in a food chain. A food chain always starts with trophic level 1 and trophic level 1 is always placed at the bottom of the pyramid. This level is occupied by producers who capture radiant energy and convert it into chemical bond energy which makes it available to the rest of the trophic levels as it passes through the food chain. The second trophic level is occupied by primary consumers or herbivores. These organisms only consume producers and are always found at trophic level 2. The third trophic level and fourth trophic level are occupied by secondary and tertiary consumers. The thing to remember about energy as it flows through an ecosystem is that 90% of the energy is used and lost between, between trophic levels. Only 10% is stored in the biomass of the next level. So in this example, if you look at trophic level 1, if there was 1,000 kilograms of biomass, that biomass would only be able to support 100 kilograms at the second trophic level. And then the third trophic level would only be able to support 10 kilograms. And the fourth trophic level would be only able to support 1 kilogram of biomass. This is why when you're in an ecosystem, you see a lot of biomass of producers. And then as you look for organisms that are occupying the second, third, and fourth trophic level, you will find less and less biomass of those organisms as you move up the trophic levels. As you get further and further away from the first trophic level, you're getting further and further away from the primary energy source, which is radiant energy. And because 90% of the energy is lost between trophic levels, there is less and less energy available for the next trophic level so less biomass is able to be supported as you go up the trophic levels. I hope this helps you stay comfortably seated on the biotrain.